Hi guys, I'm going to tell you a little bit more about the tracking system and wind protection. Tilting construction in east-west direction expect a different type of wind security procedure. Single axis and dual axis tilting needs the same procedure but only to to the east-west axis direction. Hope we understand that. Let's concentrate on the dual A-axis stroke linear actuator manage and trackers. For that we can use two type of procedures depending if we have tilt sensor. The tilt sensor is done by two inductive position sensors left and right behind metal cover. We recommend to make and install that simple tilting position sensor with two inductive sensors or optical, magnetic and even two physical limit switches. In here we have two inductive sensors and the sheet of metal as a cover. Each time the construction is tilted we always know in which direction. One of two sensors is activated if tilted and only if tilted. If flat, both of sensors are activated. If I have this type of configuration, I know where the construction is when the wind is coming. Let's consider a typical tracker operation. Tilt sensor simulation is on top left corner. Green sheet is the sensor cover activator. Blue sheet is the tracker tilted towards south and in the middle of east-west actuator position, both EW tilt sensors active. When a strong wind is detected, we want to have a flat position also on SN axis. This is the same as going to max north position. Now let's go to the beginning of the day position. And in the middle of the day, and at the end of the day, whenever we are, we want to know on which side the construction is tilted. To make sure we are starting correct driver toe set construction flat as soon as possible. So when we have a strong wind, first of all, we will consider east-west axis position. Thanks to sensor, we know on which side we are tilted, so we can start in that case east driver. The driver will be stopped when both sensors will be activated. The flat position confirmed. Sensor state confirms that we are flat on east-west, so we can stop the motor and start the other axis movement. Step 2. Setting south-north axis as flat is for every single type of tracking the same. Always going to maximal north position or maximal south depends on which side of earth you are. This is typical movement, just, you know, starting the engine and going to the, to the maximal position. Maximal position automatically stopping the engine. But what's going to happen when we don't have a position sensor installed? It is also manageable in some cases, but not in the best way. And this is not recommended, not recommended. Using four timers in the REI controller settings, T7, T8, T9, and T10. A T7 is important because we have to set there. How many seconds is needed to reach the base? East maximal position is used as a base. The T7 value must be calculated correctly as maximal time to go from west max to east max. Now from the base we can use T8 timing and set how many seconds is needed to go from the base. It means from east max to the flat position this is a half of time of T7 possibly. See how can it work like Okay, let's imagine the typical situation. We have a strong wind and we don't know current tracker position. So what we are doing, we're just starting the engine to the east, to the east, even though in some case we're going to be flat and we could stop. 
could stop the engine, but we are not able to do it because we don't have a flat position for sure. Without the sensor, that's why the flat position sensor is very important. And in such way, uh, we're just going east blindly because the base is not the flat, the base is east limit switch. Uh, so now from the east limit switch, we are going back again to the west with the time T8. T8 timer led us to become flat only if it is set properly, but still with some inaccuracies. Let's assume we are in east-west axis flat. T8 is set correctly. And now all becomes simple. We use a typical well-known south-north process. Again, confirm. Flat in east-west. Let's go max north. Just go a little bit north to be flat, that's all. So in tilting type of tracker mechanisms, two type of flat positioning process exists. Depends if you are able to, to have a flat position sensor, still recommend to use them.